Okay, Hustle Nation, now all you have to do to enter to win my Lexus GS350 is purchase any one of these options here. Now, the number in the parentheses determines how many times your name will be put in a pot. So, for example, if you buy one for $25, your name will be entered in a pot three times. And if you buy one for $150, your name will be entered in the pot 100 times. But any of these options here grants you entry uh, to win my Lexus GS350. It's just the number in the parentheses is going to determine how many times your name be entered in the pot. And you can always go here and change the quantity here. So you can put five if you want to, which comes up to 750 bucks. Of course, the link to the website is going to be in the link in the description, in the comment section, and of course, on the screen right in front of you. Don't forget, the winner of the giveaway will be flown in with a free plane ticket paid for by me so you can pick up your car and your title. We Hustle Daily. What's going on, Hustle Nation? Welcome back to another video. It's your boy, Big Play Ray, coming to y'all with another video. Man, um, I guess my um, Camry that I ran in Copart, which is crazy because I actually bought it from this IAA. This is the IAA I bought it from, and now I'm running it in Copart. So I know I dropped the Camry off to the auction maybe like yesterday, like two days ago. Um, I have not um, seen it come up on the um, on the sale yet, so I'm thinking it's probably gonna run next week. So we gotta wait on that. Um, definitely looking forward to getting my money back for that car. Let me just tell you, uh, and like I say, we won't be doing that again, especially like not on a camera. You know, I, I talked to you guys about this. I don't got to, you know, go through it again, but uh, welcome back to the channel, guys. We are back here. Did I even do my like we hustle daily? I don't, I don't even know if I did. But yeah, man, I'm looking for some cars, man. We got to see what we can find. I was looking for a Kia Forte. Kia. Oh, there it is. Oh, wait, is that in a... Uh, it's like two cars i'm not sure i'm not sure which one um that was exactly what i was looking for okay right here i think i know this is one right here it's like a kia or something oh man oh and the maxima it's like a kia and the maxima so we got a sorrento and we got a maxima two cars that i'm not like super crazy about honestly I honestly could have, I don't know. I honestly, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I haven't been to the auction in like a week. But I ain't gonna lie. Like, I could have kind of could have even skipped today. Honestly, I just got so much stuff out. My boy Bruce did say I can keep the truck over there though, but I don't know, man. I just didn't want to take it all the way over there. Oh, this thing is kind of filthy, man. So, we got a Kia Sorento. It's hella dirty. I don't know why people keep their cars like that. This is a 2016. Eh, this may go for a good amount of money though, because it's a 2016. Pretty sure it's gonna go pretty high. And we got a Maxima here. Thought I seen something going on with the Maxima. Got some good tires on there. Oh, that's what I've seen. It's got a flat. Let's see? Well, not a flat. It's got a donut on it. Oh, look at that Lexus. I think that's an electric joint. Oh, I don't think I want to even crank this one up. This one got the CVT transmission. Y'all know about them CVTs, man. Stay away. Please stay away. All right, and then we got a, it's the electric Lexus right here, the hybrid, I believe. Not electric, hybrid. Yep. Hybrids. They always give the hybrids like the clear lights. What, are, what is this again? HS. HS. Uh, I don't even know. I could have 
actually not even like these are cheap those oh no it's kind of it's kind of decent leather i don't know what happened to it, it like it was a burn on that side I honestly could have just like stayed at the crib today. Cause uh, I could have stayed at the crib today. Cause I ain't gonna lie, like I mean, if I just seen something that is just like I have to have it, then yeah, I will buy it and and, and set it over to Bruce crib. You know what I mean? I would do that, but. If it ain't nothing that I just like really want, cause I just got so much stuff right now that's not selling. So much stuff that's not selling. Getting so many hits on my cars. Like you just get hits after hits, especially after I lowered the Camry. I lowered the Camry. Listen, I lowered the Camry. Put it like this. The Camry is at a price right now online. And I got more in it than the listing price. And I'm still willing to go, I'm negotiable on the price that I'm listed at. Y'all see what I'm saying? So, you're getting, I'm getting hella hits on a convertible. I'm getting hella hits on the Camry. Y'all know I have not posted the ES. I'm set, I'm driving the ES, the gold car. Y'all know I have not. Um, posted the truck. Still trying to hold on to the truck. I just checked on a truck the other day. Was I recording? I forgot. No, I wasn't. I, I even said that in the video. I forgot to record. But yeah, so I just checked up on the truck. Um, I don't know, man. It's just hard out here right now. Ain't nothing selling, man. I'm getting so many inquiries, but nobody is is sorry, my luggage. Nobody is buying nothing. So it's just crazy. You just get like hits. Like you just get hits. Like. Is this available? Is this available? Is this available? And nobody comes out. You know what I mean? And nobody's talking about coming out. If you tell them, yeah, it's available, then they don't want to talk no more right after that. Or you get a low ball price that's like three, two or three thousand dollars lower than what you got in the car. And you just got to tell them, no, you don't even really want to. I don't personally even want to talk to them no more because it's just they just testing the orders. Like, let's just say you got a car on there for ten thousand. Somebody offer you eight. Man, I don't even want to talk to you, bro. You know what I mean? So, let me see what else we can find in here. I'll be with y'all in a minute. Yeah, I was walking past this car, and I had to show y'all the interior. Let me show y'all the car first. That's that Avalon, right? You don't see the Avalon too much on the street, do y'all? Let me know in the comments, do y'all see the Avalon? I don't really be seeing the Avalon like that. But anyway, check out the interior on the freaking Avalon, bro. Just a new Avalon. Holy got the stitching on the doors look at the seats is that like two-tone brown no that's just regular brown you can see it there we go y'all y'all can see it now it got a sunroof you feel me they give you that black and that caramel it doesn't give you the caramel with the because some of the caramel will be having like the light interior but the floor and everything is this mug hard. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. What y'all think? I like it. Even the steering wheel is on the steering wheel too. Gave you the blue button. Oh, this hybrid. Seventy thousand miles on it. It's mug nice. What y'all think? Let me know in the comments, man. Just want to show y'all that. Even a little wood grain right here. Pretty clean. Sleeping on the Elmar. All right. Oh, girl, put the vinyl on her car. Y'all know that, like, I think this is vinyl. Like, it's not the wrap. Like, I think you can buy this, right? And then you can, like, just put it on your car yourself. It looked like she just, well, maybe somebody did it. Or maybe she could have did it herself. But I like cars. I like when girls give their car cars a little design. I ain't going to lie. I do. Oh, we gotta see what she looking like. We gotta see what she looking like, y'all. So, wait a minute. Oh, this the E? Wait a minute. Yeah, that's the E. X5.
Hmm. Not the best looking on the inside. This whole door has got like, I guess it got taken off. She just had a, a baby. Sheesh. Dust everywhere that freaking bulldozer just came by. All right, guys, I'm not going to lie. I kind of wasted my time coming out here today. I kind of wasted my time coming out here today. I don't even know what I'm doing out here, man. I got stuff for sale and hardly anywhere to put stuff. You know what I mean? So you just got to wait and see what's going on. I'm going to walk up here. I remember I still like, I need to go back to buying stuff like that. I know y'all don't like seeing stuff like that, though. Y'all don't like seeing stuff like that. A little Saturn. But them the cars that just sell before you fucking go to sleep. That should have sell. But listen, if I bought this car, it'll sell before I... As soon as I posted it, I'll sell it. Before I go to sleep, I'll sell it. Literally. That's how cheap, that's how fast cheap cars sell. Especially if they run it good. But, um... What else was I gonna tell y'all, man? I don't know. Seems like it's hard out here for a pimp right now. Trying to get these cars sold. Um, yeah, I'm gonna tell y'all like the type of conversations. Yo, listen. This, this, listen, I'm gonna tell you this type of conversations. That's why when people be like, they'll do this to a car, do that to a car, they'll, I'll just change this and put more money on like uh add it to the price bro let me tell y'all the type type of conversations me and dealers have when we sell cars right my homeboy bought a car the other day my homeboy bought a car the other day he already bought the car like he already kind of paid for the car you know he didn't even want to pay that much right bought the car doom driving home driving it home the fuel pump going out he on the phone like as it's happening call me he like listen he like Man, I can't afford to put no more money in this car. You feel me? Like, bro, that's how it be. It's not all sugar. Like, it's not all sweet. You feel me? It's not all goddamn just... What's the word? What they call it? When everything's going good? Y'all know what I'm trying to say. But it's not It's not all, yeah, all sunshine and rainbows. You know what I'm saying? This is real out here. You feel me? Now he might, might lose money on the car. You already paid for the car. Felt like he overpaid. And now we got to put more money on it. So now he like man like stressed out like man i can't afford to put more money in this car you feel me so that's just how it be y'all so you know don't think everything is just all good and gravy when you you think that you could just you feel me so look at this i'm so sick of this car i'm so sick of it it's the same one too yep same interior everything everything's the same same color, look. Same color. With the, with the metallic in the paint. Same interior. This one a hybrid, though. Damn. This one got 259,000 miles on it. Holy. Oh, this one got a sunroof, though. But yeah, man. I appreciate y'all for tuning in and rocking with me, man. I'm going to call it today. Appreciate y'all. Y'all know I love y'all. Appreciate y'all for y'all support. I'm out, man. There ain't really nothing in here today. And even if I did see something, I would have to like really like it, you know, to buy it right now. All right. What's going on, Hustle Nation? If you're interested in learning how to buy, sell, properly inspect these cars at auctions or private party sales, make sure you head over to whdacademy.com. You're going to learn how to spot a bad car in seconds, how to get your dealer license, how not to get scammed from the auctions or private parties, and how not to get a limit. I got a lot of tips, a lot of tricks, and a lot of techniques in this academy that's going to teach you everything you need to know to be successful in this auction game. I didn't help thousands of other people you can see what they're saying i have helped all these people here you see in the comment section and who has been replying about the my academy so make sure you check out the website guys i got two options on there for you guys you get the full curriculum or i can just give you the basic 
how to inspect car package. See you guys on the inside if you're interested. This video has been sponsored to you by Auto A Stat. Now, Auto A Stat is a tool that I use to help me find out if cars were staged in Copart. For example, this 2021 Cadillac CT5 was sold for $24,800. But if you go down, you can actually see more information about the car. You can see that it was vandalized. That's why it's here. The car starts and everything. But if you go all the way down to the sales history you can see that the car was also sold in 2021 and you can find out more information about it it was uh, sold by the insurance company state farm but if you click it you can also see that the car had another lot number that sold for 20,000 if you look at the photos here you can also see that this car actual damage was right here on the side there so that means that someone bought the car fixed the doors and then resold it back in Copart for $24,800 and they actually did the writing themselves so they were the ones who vandalized the car this website can also be used if you want to know how much I bought my cars for because I never really tell you guys how much I pay for cars so you can also find how much I pay for cars and if something is fishy going on with the car so if you are interested my link is in the description below make sure you sign up with my referral link and lastly this website can also be used for Copart and IAA so here's the Copart website all you would have to do is copy the lot number or the VIN number or you can go to IAA and also just copy the lot number so here's the lot number here and all you would do is set it up top and there you go so it works for IEA and Copart and lastly there is a monthly subscription I personally use the pro package which is $49.95 but you can also get the personal um, package which is $19.95 you can look up cars in the last two years and with the pro package you can look up cars in the last four years but when I tell you guys it is worth it it is really worth it it has helped me save a lot of money